Hello, welcome to my channel, Wing Spiritual Clarity. My name is Wendy Wing. I'm doing a psychic tarot reading for you, tuning into the day's energy, seeing what divine messages of guidance come through. Wow. This is a general reading, so take what resonates and leave the rest. In the past, we have the Hermit in Reverse. feels like I don't want to be alone anything but being alone feels like being alone is the the worst thing possible but it looks like the people in your environment are not for you feels like there's a lot of betrayal a lot of negative talk feels like it's a lot of talk behind your back it doesn't feel like anybody's talking to you with you feels like they're talking about you it's so interesting like nobody is talking to you addressing you connecting with you Feels like they're coming to a judgment. Feels like you're being judged. Feels like, um, it feels like you're being ousted from a group, a family, a friend group, job, car horn. wild it, it feels like everybody around you knows what's happening in regards to you feels like you might perceive something about this but there's nothing you can do no one's talking to you they're talking about you there's a lot of talk about you oh okay um the way okay it looks like the talk about you has a lot to do with um, feels like they're throwing around crazy maybe that's why they're not talking to you they're talking about you it feels like you're being handled it feels like it feels like you're being ousted from a group what I'm perceiving here is this is creating an opportunity for you a new opportunity this obviously this environment they're not for you it does look like there's an energy maybe of someone who cares about you in this environment but they're they're not standing up for you feels like they're enabling this behavior it doesn't feel like anybody's standing up for you it feels like everybody's in agreement pretty generally as i'm perceiving it that you no longer belong in this group and it feels painful because you've got a belief that anything but being alone. So it feels like you're wanting to stay in this group even though they don't like you or they don't accept you. They don't perceive you as capable of having these this communication. There's something there. It feels like they've painted you as crazy what can I say I there's something here swirling around and the decision has been made that you need to leave you are being removed from this this group and what's really amazing is it feels like 
this is happening for you, not the it's happening for you on a much bigger profound level that it feels like you need to see that these are not your people <laughs> to not fight to stay in the groups that don't care about you or for you wow all right in this current energy we have the high priestess you're very intuitive empathic psychic You might consider that you have six senses, you might perceive um, energy in a very real way, not just imaginary, but it feels like you work with energy. You might be Reiki, a Reiki worker, energy worker, light worker. There's something about how you're showing up in this current energy as the high priestess. Very solidly, maybe even more publicly showing up as the high priestess. That somehow counteracts whatever the crazy talk about you in the past. It looks like you're very discerning now. You've learned a lot from going through this situation in the past. You're much more discerning. Feels like once you got out of an environment where everybody around you is not for you, they don't even want you there, they're talking negatively about you. Once you finally allowed yourself to be separated from that environment that you're much more discerning now it feels like whoever was in that environment talking about you judging you pushing you out that you're not talking with them anymore you have this incredible strength from what you've gone through you faced your fears you're very discerning Someone's coming in with loving communication. They are hoping that this communication helps cut through some confusion. From the past, this feels like a past person because what they're talking about came out in the past energy. So they want to talk about the lies. The lies that were told in the past. Okay, they're now seeing things differently. They're reworking. It feels like uh, whoever's coming forward, they, as I'm tuning into it, they do seem genuine. They're, they're not bringing confusion. They really do want to talk about the lies in the past. They're no longer drinking the Kool-Aid. They've reworked things. They It feels like this person is seeing you positively. Wow, there might be a lot more people than just this one person. It feels like there's someone coming forward in a loving manner. They're, it does feel like an apology. It doesn't feel like they're any, they're, it feels like someone controlled the narrative and there's someone, it, it feels like, I don't th feel like you're expecting this. <laughs> this feels like, this feels, this feels like whatever group you were ousted from in the past, feels like there was someone in control of the narrative, someone who was telling everybody that you were crazy, saying things in a way that everybody believed. They got you out of that environment and you've had a glow up since you were ousted. You're doing really well. You followed your intuition. You've cut these people out. You are very confident now. 
and it feels like someone's reworked things. They're seeing things differently. This feels like an apology. This feels like this person might be the ambassador from a, a friend group or whatever group this person's from, uh, saying like, we all see you differently. We're all sorry. It feels like someone's stepping forward with an apology, but they're, it feels like there's a lot of people seeing things differently, seeing you differently. It doesn't feel like you stayed and argued to try to convince people to see you. It feels like you moved on and had a huge glow up, huge. And now these people see the truth. It doesn't feel like they're, they believe the person who said this, these unkind things about you. You have a lot of luck on your side right now. It feels like you've made your luck, created it by facing your fears, using your discernment. Okay, so this is about the person from your past. It feels like the... Um, wanted people to stop investing in you. They created quite a story about you. Oh, they switched. So they, they uh, whatever this person was doing, they said that you were doing it. That's how it became so believable because these people could read that energy, but it was really them. They were being cruel to you. They told quite a story about how cruel you were to them. And it's the exact opposite. If they're children, it feels like um, they said you were bad with the kids or bad to the kids, something like that. But that's them. People are seeing this. This person's being called out in a big way. This person might um, have felt so powerful from being able to control other people's stories and get people to do their bidding by controlling the narrative. So I don't, I get the feeling that this person that did this to you in the past, that People are now seeing who they are. It, I get the feeling that they have they didn't just play this game with you. It feels like they played this game with other people and they're getting caught. Wow, they are really getting caught. <clears throat> it's a hopeless situation. This might be public. This might be the law being called in. This person tried to create an incredible unhappiness for you. They tried to destroy you, someone very kind and sweet. It feels like this person has a habit of doing this, trying to control people, trying to control other people's narrative, trying to manipulate, trying to make themselves look good. There's someone coming in This person coming in to apologize to you might be coming in because publicly <clears throat> it feels like something is has happened. It feels like this person is being publicly seen in a negative light. You could have been married to this person. It feels like <clears throat> for some of you, this person is sick. Short illness reverse. It feels like this has been um, a sick game that this person has been playing for a long time. And it's coming out in this current energy wow 
I feel like this unexpected reversal of fortunes here feels like because you didn't engage in this energy, because you took your energy and focused it on you and what you want to create, without your energy, the plan didn't work. The plan fell apart. You took your energy elsewhere. That inner, it would have worked if you would have stayed engaged in the energy, if you would have fought. It feels like you just took your energy and went elsewhere. And by taking yourself and your energy away, it took the energy away from what this person was trying to create for you. Wow. All right. In what's hidden, we've got the nine of swords in reverse. Getting out of a stuck place, leaving a nightmare. Leaving a comfort zone. Two of cups. Okay. It looks like it looks like I'm talking with someone who stays or in the past at least, stayed in a relationship because it was a comfort zone. It, it looks like this relationship was a nightmare. It was not for you. It was not your happiness. Nine of cups reverse, ace of cups reverse. Feels like you gave everything to this relationship and this person, but it wasn't for you. At least at some point, it feels like it, switched and this was not for you the relationship it feels like you're in a relationship you're staying because it's a comfort zone you're giving everything to this person to this relationship but it's not loving it's not loving for you it's not in alignment with you i think you might have been raised to relationship in this way to give everything to the relationship and ask nothing in return and i think you're reworking that that's no longer a comfort zone for you you see it for what it is once a one-sided relationship Wow. I'm also seeing that you you might have been raised that you are nothing alone. Wow, the hermit reversed. You are nothing alone. You have to be part of a partnership. Maybe that's how you were raised. You have to be in a relationship. You're nothing unless someone else values you. You're nothing unless someone else picks you and chooses you and to be in a relationship with. And what I'm getting is it looks like you chose yourself. That you're a star, that you have divine feminine qualities. It feels like you needed to see who you really were, who you really are. Maybe you're still discovering that and that you're no longer working with energies that don't invest in you, don't want to work with you, that expect you to do all the work, that lie, that manipulate, that deceive. It feels like you've healed that, that wound. You're no longer feeling dependent on someone. You're really stepping into your star quality and your divine feminine. It looks like you've, you're birthing or you've birthed a new reality for yourself. Wow. All right. In the outcome and advice, we have two of wands in reverse. A 
lack of strategy, not leaving the house, no plan, no passion, no desire. It feels like that's what the part of the plan was. It feels like the goal in all of this from this person in your past was to get you to never make moves again, to unable to move, leave the house. But instead, it looks like you reworked things. It looks like you, again, didn't engage in this energy. Stopped seeing this person as your burden. Didn't engage, didn't try to convince people of your side of things. It feels like this person put you in a very stuck position and you allowed yourself to rework, see things from a different perspective. I think you recognize that these people and from your past are not for you. They're not options. You started, You. it looks like you stopped drinking the Kool-Aid. Stop feeling stuck that you, this is the only environment I can have. This is the only thing. Yeah, there were, it, there were a lot of fears keeping you stuck in the past. Keeping you in a comfort zone with people who are not for you. For some of you, it feels like this could very well be a marriage. And so there is a belief like no divorce. I can't get a divorce. I can't separate from this whatever, this person. So you tried every other option. It feels like this person took advantage of those beliefs that you have, that you're not going to get a divorce, that you can't be alone. And so they um, treated you accordingly. They felt very confident in treating you really cruelly because they never thought you would leave. They thought they had control over you, your story, your moves. They felt that you were completely enmeshed and that they had control over you. That you would never find your confidence. That you would never perceive them. Feels like they... they Ooh, that's really cruel. It's really cruel. The, again, the crazy story that you're dependent, that you can't do anything on your own, that it's not that you're empathic and that you've got attunement or skills. It's you're delusional and crazy. Like that's the story. You can't live on your own. You're dependent on others. You're completely enmeshed. This person can say you'll do whatever this person says. You're stuck completely. That was, it feels like the strategy. And everything you've done is just showing who you really are. And it doesn't match what this person has said. And be, But now people are reworking and seeing this person for who they really are feels like their actions have shown people who they are feels like they're getting in trouble by how they've behaved feels like the law feels um and people do not want to work with, with this person they are moving away quickly it feels like they can't move away fast enough And again, they're coming in with this communication. They're wanting to tell you that um, that they're seeing things differently. 
that they're guarded against this person, that they've now separated from this person. And some of you who have kids, it even feels like a child might be involved. It even feels like the child or children are kind of like, feels like everyone's taking big steps back from this person who tried to decimate you. And it feels like they played that game with a lot of people in their environment and it feels like they're getting caught. So, all right, that's your reading. I hope that was helpful. Take care.